Back in November, I became the 100th woman to fly to space. Going to space has been something that I've dreamed about and worked toward for two decades. And I want you to join me as I prepare for and embark on my trip to the stars. Three days before our launch, we arrive in Texas. That's one small step for man, one giant leap for mankind. Texas has always played an important role in space exploration, but we're not headed to NASA. We're headed to the middle of the West Texas desert to Blue Origin Launch Site 1, where they launch and land astronauts in a rocket of their own design. Unlike the rockets used by Neil Armstrong, Sally Ride, and Mae Jemison, to name a few, the rocket we'll be flying in is fully autonomous and 99% reusable. This means there are no spacecraft pilots on board, and the entire rocket will be autonomously launched into space 62 miles above the planet and autonomously landed back down on Earth. We're flying in the New Shepard rocket, named after the first American in space, Alan Shepard, who flew a similar flight trajectory as our flight. 